Come here, come here, baby. Oh, oh my god. god. Holy shit. Hey guys, it's Randomizer here. Today we're going to be talking about an Apex Legends weapon called the Bow Check Bow. It, it was added back in Apex Legends Season 9 Legacy. Um, it, it was added... It was added into that season, um, and so, yeah, so what I'm saying is, uh, the bow, the bow check bow was added into Apex, um, on season nine, which was May 4th of 2021. On the day of its release, the gun was originally really overpowered and was really, really accurate, d did a ton of damage, and... And overall, it, it was a very good weapon for the first couple days of Season 9. H however, when it got a nerf and uh, when it got an ammo nerf, and overall, pe overall people just, um, when people just ended up forgetting about this gun, that's when it really started to plummet downwards. And its usage rate began to completely, it was completely destroyed in, at the end of season nine and in season ten, the bow the bow check bow was like the least um, it was the least used weapon least used weapon in season ten and even in uh, the latest season of um, the even in the latest season of Apex Legends season eleven Escape uh, the gun it isn't used at all anymore and we're we're going to be talking about. Um, what happened to the Bosec bow, or uh, as most Apex Samaritans call it? And actually, by the way, this is named after the um, this is named after the Apex dev David Bosec, so or David Bocek, uh, uh, however you pronounce his name. So that's what the gun's actually named after. Fun fact: it's named after David Bocek, one of the w one of the weapon designers at um, and one of the yeah one of the weapon handlers at. Um, Respawn Entertainment, uh, the one who manages all the weapons and, you know, balances all the weapons for Apex Legends, if you know what I mean. But, but, but anyways, back on track. So, yeah, let's just get into the Bocek Bows story, shall we? So, a as I just said in roughly the beginning of this video, um, the gun was um, added into the game on May 4th of 2021, a.k.a. Season 9 of Apex. It is an actual bow and arrow in Apex. That, that's what the gun is. That's what the gun is, a bow and arrow. And um, um, this gun uses its own ammo type called arrows. I mean, what, what more, you know, it's not going to be called anything else. It's literally a bow and arrows. Yeah, bow and arrow. It shoots arrows. And, uh... The the color of the the color of the ammo type arrows is a sort of yeah a, a ba it's a um a beige color the ammo so the the arrow ammo is a beige slash tannish it, it, it's a very tan color uh yeah it's a very tan color that ammo just just so you guys know um w what the ammo is like and um it can't you know. This ammo only applies to the bow check. Um, it ca obviously cannot. Um, there's no other ammo that uses arrows but that gun, the, the, the bow. It is also in the marksman class of weapons, which means um, it's a mix between a sniper, a sniper rifle, and an AR. It has, you know, a move, it has a movement, an ADS movement speed in between an assault rifle and a sniper, and, um, it, and it can equip, um, like, it can equip some scopes that zoom in pretty far, just not as far as a sniper. Um, j yeah, just not as, yeah, it can equip scopes, but just not as far as, like, a sniper rifle can. That can equip um, scopes that could, you know, th those guns can equip scopes that could just, you know, zoom into something a lot. But, 
uh, the bow check and other marksman weapons obviously can't. But but um, the interesting thing about the bow check, however, uh, unlike unlike any other marksman weapon, um, it can equip a two x to a four x variable variable scope. So it can only um, the bow check can only equip up to a one x to a three x ranger and nothing else. They can't even equip to a 2x uh, to 4x AOG scope, which um, other other marksmen like uh, the G7 Scout, Triple Take, and 3030, th those three weapons can equip those scopes, however, but the bow check can't. Now, that doesn't really make sense to me because here's the thing. Uh, the bow check, also, it also equips other zoom-in scopes as well, um, so I don't understand why it can't go up to it can't go up to a the a two x to a four x that kind of doesn't make sense to me because it it can equip other zoom in it, it can equip other zoom in scopes but just not you know just not this one well it it can equip only one zoom one zoom in scope but hey it can equip a zoom in scope why can't it equip another zoom in scope. Um, it, if you know what I mean, um, if that makes any sense. Um, so, um, anyways, so, so how the bow check works is that, um, basically it fires anywhere between 190 to 200 rounds per minute, um, to like a hundred, a hundred rounds per minute. So the longer you hold down on the trigger, uh, the more damage you'll do. The original bow check bow had a headshot multiplier. Um, it still does have a headshot multiplier of this, by the way, but it has a headshot multiplier of 1.75 times. Um, and the original damage of the bow check, when you fully charged up a shot, you know, if you wanted to fire it at basically a hundred rounds per minute, uh, the max amount of the max amount you could be able to do on the bow check back in the very, very early days of season nine was, was 70 damage and times that by 1.75. Well, that was, um, it was possible to do 123 damage or in season nine, there was the starter kit. You were equipped, equipped with a gray helmet and a shield. So headshots, no headshots were still in the one hundreds back then, but you, you know, I just want, I just want to explain that, but the, but the damage was, you know, the, you know, it was pretty high. Like it was in the one hundreds and 70 damage for, you know, uh, 70 damage for a marksman weapon and a ground loot weapon is very high. And that's what the, uh, when the bow check first released, um, the, that's the amount of damage, um, that's the amount of damage that you could do with it. The the maximum amount, obviously, because you have to ch ch charge up your shots with it. And you know, once again, the longer the the longer you hold on the trigger, um, the more damage you'll do. And then if you want to just spam fire fire it really quick, which I don't recommend you do with the bow check, uh, with the bow check bow, you get like tiddly winks amount of damage. Like, um, the minimum amount you could get on the bow is. Uh, 25 damage, and, uh, yeah, and basically you get, like, no headshot damage when you just spam the thing, and you can't really, you, you can't really ADS when you're, when you're zooming in with the thing. Ooh, sorry about, sorry about that, my bad, D duh, um, anyway, um, anyways, so the, um, the, the bow check bow could not equip any attachments, literally, uh, it couldn't equip stocks, barrel stabilizers, etc., etc., because of the design of the gun. Obviously, it being a bow and arrow, it can't equip. It cannot equip those things, which is understandable. But, but um, however, um, once again, it could equip a scope, and um, so un unlike any gun, it can equip the bow check can equip. Uh, two hop-ups at the same time, and those hop-ups are the Dead Eyes Tempo, which also applies to the Sentinel, and Shatter Caps, which also replies, which also applies to the thirty thirty repeater uh, lever lever action rifle. Yeah, yeah, that's what that gun is. Um, but anyways, whole different gun. So, 
Uh, the bow check, basically, if you, the bow check bow, what shatter caps did to it, first of all, you could toggle it on and off, which was a nice feature. And, um, w and what it did to the gun is it turned it into a shotgun. Like the spread, like if you were to toggle the, um, the shatter caps on, it would change, um, into a, like an actual shotgun, like it would get a shotgun spread and the, and the damage was more spread out. There was like pellets and stuff with, with the, the pellet, you know, the pellet thing applied with the shatter caps. It, it, it was basically, it act, um, the, the 3030 and the bow check bow with shatter caps basically acted like a shotgun, if you know what I mean. And, um, dead eyes tempo basically made it so that the bow check, um, so that the Bosec shot faster at the right time. However, it doesn't, I find that it doesn't really work on the boat. Like I don't, I hardly ever notice it on the Bosec. So um, like I hardly ever notice a fire rate increase even with the Dead Eyes tempo. So um, yeah, it, it, it's not really that effective effective on the thing. The gun was freaking overpowered and absolutely insane. Um, you know, you know, just aiming at an opponent with this thing, you could literally hit, you could hit 470 damage body shots in a row, um, you know, with, without like any inaccuracies, like, like it was hardly ever inaccurate. Um, you could literally hit, you could literally hit like a burst of three or five. Um, and you know, you could do like, 200 damage with it in like three seconds and like like without a problem and yeah a lot of people and definitely a lot of pros started to complain about it very they started to complain about the bow very early on and um you you're gonna see what i mean right now oh. 60 63 uh, shoot the middle guy i don't have an angle Oh my god, he got him. Oh my god. Crack blood on. One or two blood. 70. 70 crack on that guy on the, sh on the package. I killed, the, I killed all three, so package, one is self -res. No, 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 package, package, package. Self-res? Mind you. Oh, 70. what the fuck? They want to fight, by the way. They're reporting. They did. Hollow on the boat? So, one on two on the right. I <laughs> Yeah. Oh, fucking juice. They want it. 70 broken on bank. Give me crack. Give me bubble. Give, give me his one. One guy's in the open right here. 70. 70 again. He's uh, 10 HP. Oh, crack. God. <laughs> Fucking hit me with the bow in the crate at the same time. Incoming care package. We got this. He was on the top. He was on the top. The red. Full red. Hi. Going up on mid. You're fighting. Hundred two red headshot. I'm griefing this fight! Give his one! <laughs> that guy's dead. Oh fuck. Fuck iron sighting, bro! Who needs a fucking iron sight in this gun? Look, he's here. Nice, Vegan, bro. They're running. They're on yeah. the right over here. Off the top, off the top. Good short. Yeah. I'm pushing left, pushing left. All the way to the ring. They're stuck Clean on my left right here. Okay, like head glitch? Okay. Watch out! Bro, I fucking... Oh! Here, bro. Oh! 
60 on Gibby again. I'm ulting this. Somebody 60 shooting on bang. On station. 60 on Gibby again. They Gibby ulted, they bang ulted. I'm wide. I'm portaling through them. I'm nading their RV. They portaled out too. RV. I got the Gib. Wraith broken. I got a heal. Wraith dead. Yep. Bang. Wait, what? I just no the bang. Bang 60. 70. Train, train, train. Third party. Get in the 70. RV. Get in the one, RV. One, get in 140, 140 on this guy on the bins. Gibby cocked. I bubbled, I bubbled. I don't have- bang I don't cocked. have a med yet. Bang one on the bin, bang one on the bin. In the air, it's a simulation. 70 cocked wraith. 60 nice. oh. 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 Ты стикаешь, да? Ты стикаешь, да? Ты Ты They call me fucking Legolas. Gotta flap these wings faster. Wings out close. Wings out. Give me his blue, give me his blue. No buff, no buff. Five on one HP! Five on dead! Give me one HP! Get a spot with that. Oh my god! Oh my god, <laughs> what a Jesus! Guy. Headshot her. She's behind these crates solo. 112 headshot. She's running away, hit 112 already, on a purple. Oh, they're taking portal. Someone just shot a zip up here in front of me. Crack path. Crack that kid. Crack that kid. I don't have an angle. Oh, nice. bro. Enemy taken out. Like. Timber. Oh, what the fuck? The fuck? The just double head shot this guy. <laughs> Overall, the weapon was really annoying and it needed a change. Luckily, in the May 11th patch, both the Spitfire and the Bow Check Bow, which is here on the screen right now, so, so these are the changes that were done to the Bow Check Bow. Um, th this was a nerf um, it, in the patch state you're seeing on the screen right now. And um, yeah, overall, after this nerf, the Bow Check uh, felt way more balanced. It wasn't overpowered anymore it just it honestly felt pretty balanced and not too hard not too down bad anymore it felt balanced at this point we have fast forwarded to apex legends season 10 and um at, at that point, at that point in time, the the bow check bow, like nobody really nobody used it anymore. It was completely like com it was a completely dead gun. N no more recent information was on it, and um, overall, it, it really wasn't up updating with the times. Um, there was a new season of Apex that launched. Obviously, I mentioned season 10. The Rampage was added, which was an LMG, and it was really freaking good. It was much better than the 
Bocek, which was the previous new, re- which was the second newest release at the time, um, and, and it was released in last season, season nine. So honestly, I think the Bocek bow, honestly, its fate was sealed after they nerfed the amount of arrow ammo um, you could stack, and after they nerfed the arrow ammo stack count. Um, I, I honestly think it did it. I think that change did it for the gun. Um, no, it became less, less and less used. And, and by season 10 and even season 11, um, people have stopped using it. And, um, they tried buffing it a little bit in season 10, in season 10 of Apex, but that hasn't worked out at all. And, and honestly, I think it's just because other weapons, you know, I think it's the way that the bow check works is is why it's not used. Bow and arrows, they're not commonly used in video games. And I think for the bow check, um, the, the for that gun, um, it, it really just didn't work with pe- work with people. At the end of the day, people were happy using weapons like the R99, uh, Wingman, Vault, and Peacekeeper, and other long-range weapons like the Scout and R three hundred one, and I, th- and I think be- because of that, um, people just forgot about the bow check bow. Um, you know, even after the nerf, it's it wasn't horrible. People just forgot about it. However, I think I think the bow check bow can be salvaged and saved, uh, as long as they. So if they buff. If they if they slightly buff the fire rate of the bow check, or if they slightly buff the damage, then I think it could actually be a top like it could be a pretty good weapon again, and it could be used by more people. Um, you know, I heard respawn talking about how they're going to make it better in future seasons, so that's a good thing. But in the current state that it is right now, I just don't see any more people using it. Or I don't see people using it at all. However, just know that, that this gun can be salvageable. And as, you know, as long as they slightly buff the fire rate or slightly buff the damage of this gun, but, but they also have... They, they also... Actually, no. The arrow count is fine. They did buff that. But they just, overall, they just need to slightly, either slightly buff the fire rate of the gun or slightly increase the damage. I, and I think it's good, I think it's good to go and, and really usable again. Um, you know, overall, it's not really a, a using, you can't really use the gun now, um, but I mean, it's, a, you know, it's not a horrible gun, but nobody just really uses it. If they give it the buffs that I just talked about, then I I think this gun, you know, I think this gun can be used again. Maybe the bow check bow will rise again one day. Um, But anyways, that's about it for this uh, documentary video. More to come in the future. See y'all in the next video. Goodbye.